Hi, this is Todd Liebeck with NextApp. I'm going to demonstrate how to clean unwanted items from your phone or tablet's SD card or internal memory. To do this, I'm going to use FX File Explorer's Usage View feature. This feature is available in the free version. You can get FX on the Google Play Store. Just click the link below. When you start FX, you'll see a home screen like this one. Choose either Main Storage or Media Card under the Files heading to open the area where you'd like to free space. I'm using a phone that only has internal storage, so I'm going to tap Main Storage. Note that the current amount of free space is shown on this screen. We're now looking at the files and folders of this phone's storage. To start using FX's Usage View feature, tap the View menu and select Usage View. At this point, FX will analyze the amount of space consumed by each file and folder on the device. This may take a moment. This is the usage view. The bar at the top of the screen contains information about the folder that we're looking at. In this case, we're looking at the top-level storage folder of the phone. The first pie chart shows you how much space this folder is using relative to the free space. The second chart shows you what kind of files are contained within this folder by breaking them down into five categories documents, images, audio files, video files, and other files. On the far right are some raw statistics, indicating how many files and subfolders are within this folder. The total data size of the folder is also shown. If you can't see the entire top bar, you can scroll it to the right by dragging it. In the file listing, you'll see how much space each item is using. The percentage label in the lower right corner next to each file indicates how much of the total size of this folder the item is using. Above the percentage label is a graphic that indicates the relative size of the item. Larger items have more dots lit up. You can navigate around just like you normally would in FX and the data in the top bar will change. When you see files and folders that you no longer want on your device, select them. In FX, you can use our swipe to select feature to quickly select multiple items. Then tap the file menu and choose delete. Make certain you really want to delete these files. Tap the checkbox and then tap delete. The files are now deleted. The usage data is automatically updated to reflect the fact that these files no longer exist. Your phone or tablet storage is used to house any files, photos, music, and videos you create, download, or otherwise place on your device. Obviously you can delete any of these files that you no longer need. Additionally, some apps will place permanent or temporary data files on your device's storage. Sometimes apps will not clean these up, and they can be orphaned if an app is uninstalled. There is a folder called Android in the root of your phone's storage. This folder is the default location where applications will place such files. If you look inside the data folder, you'll see these files categorized by the package name of the application. It may be a bit difficult to determine what package name is associated with what app. Doing a Google search for the package name can help if you see one that is very large and you are not sure what it is. You may also find application-related folders if you turn on the display of hidden files. To do this, tap the View menu and then enable the Show Hidden option. Then, look for folder names that begin with a period. It's important to understand that these files are used by applications. They are not the applications themselves. Removing them won't uninstall the app, but it can cause an installed app to malfunction. It is recommended that you only delete configuration files for applications that have been uninstalled but left files in place. This video used the free version of FX File Explorer. To get it, visit the Google Play Store by clicking the link below. This has been Todd Liebeck for Next App. Thanks for watching.